Hey, what's up everyone? This is Julian from the Binary Lab. So copy trading, gosh, can you believe you can actually make like 30 to 50% per month totally on autopilot and binary options? So this is not a typical thing that I will be mentioning. Um, but the reason why I even looked into this is because a former binary, binary, pff, binary Lab student, he messaged me to say that for the past four months, he's actually been getting 30 to 50% returns in binary options copy trading totally autopilot and he's actually looking for a few people to help him open more accounts so that he can test more strategies because i one person you only get one account so he, need, he wants more accounts so he can test i was like wow so for the longest time you know this has not been possible due to like technical challenges like latency the delay time usually will cause trades to lose on on various legit platforms and there's so many other non-legit platforms and scammy brokers that basically the moment you think you're copying someone they they bait and switch you to a different signal that will wipe out your account within a week so this guy his story made me sit up and listen and decided to get my feet wet okay so in this video i'm going to be showing you exactly how to navigate the pocket option copy trading process and i'll be giving you some of my criteria in filtering out a good signal but before that please use the link below here to sign up for your free account to support me now let's watch the video i decided to chronograph the whole process of doing it i've actually sent a small test amount to the account and uh, basically in this video i will be showing you the process of uh, doing the social copy trading and uh, i had some time to look into this interface earlier on obviously this is where you can check who is the most profitable for the day. When you're screening through these things, there are a couple of steps you need to notice. Obviously, you need to notice what is the overall uh, profitable, profitable deals. So this is the for today, um, his overall is 55, okay? And then we can see what this person performed yesterday. Did he make money yesterday? And actually, he, he did. But I think it's because you know, this person does a lot of mining deal. And uh, you can see there's a very big variance in the number of trade sizes. He starts as low as 1, and then he goes all the way to 500. Um, so he uses heavy martingale, and uh, you know such an account, you probably don't want to use it. Now, all time, we can see the statistics. Uh, what is his overall efficiency level? So this is actually quite interesting, because... Um, what is efficiency level? I'm just going to type it out here. Efficiency level equals to turnover divided by profit. And the resulting score, um, the lower, the better. Okay. So this is going to be a little formula of how we calculate this. And uh, I want to just calculate it for you so you can see. This is the overall turnover divided by profit. So we already know it's more or less like 6 to 1, just by a very visual mental calculation. 6, 6, 8, 8, 6, 8 divided by 104, 412. So 5.9. This is actually a ridiculous, ridiculously good number because that means that for every uh, six dollars turnover he's actually making a dollar profit which is pretty solid very very good so unfortunately a lot of people are watching this guy but he doesn't enable the copy trading function so I will guide you through the process of searching through and screening the other ones so we're gonna look through from top down and now we're gonna go to the second person on the list and we'll look at his yesterday daily stats today uh, minimum trade and the large trade. This one, the largest trade is only about 1.5 times bigger. So this guy doesn't really mind it too much, which is good. <coughs> Yesterday, he made money as well. Um, and again, the uh, variance between the two trade sizes is not too different. So yesterday was 63% profitable, today 100% profitable. And that's with the all time, all time 53%. But his, his overall profit is quite ridiculous. So uh, that for me is a red flag. So earlier, remember with the other guy, we had like a six times, right? Five point nine times. But this one, we're gonna look at his efficiency level, and let's take one o seven four zero five eight divided by two three four five. Okay, and this is four hundred fifty eight. This is ridiculously shit. 
So obviously we're not gonna do this this person. And one more thing I want to show you is that you know what is this uh, profile status mean? Guru, okay. So if you top up the account, you will see that there are different kind of account types. Uh, like there is the experience, the master, the pro, the guru, and I will personally think that anything that is bigger than experience means that the person is quite vested interest. That person probably like trades for a living. So, uh, and the reason why I wouldn't just focus on master to master pro guru, because sometimes you know there could be someone in China or Vietnam. They're not very rich, but they could be quite good at trading. So, I think it's good to look into all these all these categories, right? Uh, so let's get back into that trading screen, and uh, I will. I also want to show you a feature where you can you can sort by the kind of you can sort by various attributes like profitable deals, and uh, this is another way that you can search. So personally, for me, um, I would I would like to see that they've got a certain number of trades down their belt. For me, at least a thousand. Uh, or maybe I'll even consider like 500. So let's skip away all, all the way to a few pages deep because it doesn't mean anything if um, you know if someone's got 78% uh, of a very small number of trades. So I need to I need to go like many pages deep. And uh, basically, as you can see, the more the number of trades increase, um, there you go. See now this is something I'm looking at. See, after all this, we finally we we'll just go we'll go back and forth a few pages to see if that's true. Uh, but I do believe that we may have found a good trader here because you know, oh, oh what was that? What was that? What was that? I think we saw something here that had a thousand plus trades here. So I think we may have found a good trader. Um, <clears throat> just click on the stats. Click on the all time. So forty thousand divided. There's quite a lot of trades done so far. Seventy-three percent accuracy. And uh, let's look at the today trading behavior. Oh, this person is a mining gator. So I don't think, I don't think it'd be really good to follow this person. All right, you, you get you get the drift. I'm gonna basically stop the video here. And when I found a good one, I will show you the next process after I started it.